Okay, we're back. And if you saw the other video, you saw how well the Weber did with the Super Reverb going through its own speakers. Uh, but this one came with a headphone tap option, which means there's a little volume dial on the back as well as a quarter inch uh, uh, plug uh, for headphones. So you might need an adapter if you've just got the standard headphone size. Um, I tried to run it to the computer and there's just too much electronics going on here and I got a really um, um, messy signal. Uh, so instead, I'm just running a male-to-male uh, -male cable from the Sony speaker on top of the THD to the back of the Weber Mass. So here's what it sounds like through headphones, essentially. Um, it really will matter what headphones you use, whether you're using earbuds or if you have really nice bows, it'll definitely impact the sound. But here we go, on the neck. Does it sound exactly like a 64 Super Reverb? Uh, the answer is no, because we're not running it through a 4x10, we're running it through 2-inch, two, two I think, speakers out of the Sony, one or two. Uh, if we bump up the volume, maybe sound a little nicer. Let's see, back on the neck. I mean, again, if that was coming through my headphones and I didn't have a you know Vox amp plug or you know a, a computer program to run this, that's yeah, you know, really not too shabby at all. Let's drop the volume. And bring the amp up. Let's see how she handles it. lesson we learned is that the headphone tap, I think for the money, is a great option to add if you're going to uh, get one of these uh, anyway. Um, it will not exactly reproduce the sound that you would get running through guitar speakers. Uh, if we hook this up to maybe a big laptop computer set speaker, you know, much bigger drivers and a, and a subwoofer, might sound a bit better. So it really is going to be dependent on uh, what you're listening with, but for practice, and I, so now we're talking, you know, really late night um, uh, practicing, I think it's a great option. Uh, and again, it sounds uh, super, or super reverb. Um, it really just, there's going to be limitations. There's no way that little Sony can handle uh, the driven tone from the super reverb and, and reproduce it uh, even, you know, close to uh, correctly. So hope this was helpful. Happy tone hunting.